very beautiful she's an actress of course she's a singer she's an entrepreneur she's a philanthropist she does all those really like uh, great things thank you thank for buying you the membership, membership the ultimate learning experience we thank appreciate you. it so she's just really awesome um she was on green leaf um let's see she was on the family hustle with ti and tiny um and that's what a lot of people know her from when her husband was showing his his natural black you know what with her on there uh on that show but yeah that's basically just kind of give you a roundabout who latoya luck it is she also um hosts like a lot of award shows I like can. the naacp i cast in here now y'all yeah. finna get it trolls cast yeah. in here yes thank you cash shout out to you um so she hosts a lot of different award shows as well very talented very beautiful lady she's a mother She's an entrepreneur, businesswoman, content creator. She actually has a YouTube channel as well. Mm -hmm. So she has had three marriages, what, in a span of seven, eight years. Um, she first got married to Rob Hill Sr., Sr., who's a poet and content creator in 2016. And then they were married for two months. And then they divorced. And then in 2017, she got married again to her husband, I think his name is uh tomicus tomicus yeah yeah tomicus walker mm -hmm. they got married and they were married for four years um they had some really beautiful children they have a son named titan and then they have their daughter named Gianna Gigi. Mm -hmm. but they didn't stay together mm -hmm. um it was rumors of alleged infidelity with her second marriage to tomicus and I think they was also going through a lot when his mother passed at the very beginning of their marriage. Mm -hmm. So he was dealing with a lot. So that's why they ended up divorcing. And they've been divorced for about three years now. And so now she's married to this new guy. I think his name is Tello or Tilo. I can't pronounce the name. But Essence just dropped the pictures, the official pictures from her wedding. And what a coinky dink essence covered shirley strawberry and ernesto williams marriage and now they covered latoya luck it's marriage to her new husband so why do you think essence pick up on all these marriages like that because they want to promote black love and women being in love they want to celebrate y'all being happy and finding y'all mr forever it's coming from a positive place i think mm. yeah that's what they trying to do mm yeah okay. they mean well so that's what so it, the story of her wedding just broke today and uh essence magazine just released the pictures from her wedding this past saturday i believe it was this past saturday and so it went viral because nobody knew that she was actually engaged in the first place but I kind of had a feeling that she had a man because she was kind of like posting little random things like um, posting little reels and it would be like a man's hand in a picture and then she would post um, another reel where you could see like a ring on her finger but she just wasn't as public about this marriage like she was her last marriage to Tomicus because she, she basically detailed on social media the beginning stage the entire duration of her relationship with uh tomicus her ex-husband and their marriage because she was also on um the family hustle with mm -hmm. ti and tiny their their last and final season that they had before their um scandal broke mm -hmm. so you know we was all up in her business with her second husband so i think that's why she decided to um be a little bit more private this go around because we was all in her business the last the last marriage we were which is smart um i think a lot of people were still trying to figure out oh i thought you were still with the second husband you know people be slow mm -hmm. they didn't realize that um she had been gotten divorced in 2021 from the second husband she has her two kids with but i i really like the way latoya luckett did that i like the fact that she kept her courtship private and that she just popped up, popped out Mary. I personally think that was brilliant. You know, date, love, and private. Make sure that it's vetted, it's tried and true. And then if you decide you want to post pictures on social media, you know, so any yeah. any potential suitors that are interested in you, then they know, okay, she's off limits. I would have done, I, I, I like that. I actually kind of see myself doing that. 
you know, dating, courting in private, not posting on social media. Hey, and, Natasha. Hey, Natasha. How you doing, beautiful? You know, I see me doing that, you know, dating and courting in private and then popping out married because when you put your relationship on social media, you have to understand that you are going to be susceptible to a, a lot of opinions, a lot of scrutiny, and just a lot of evil eye. You know, it's a lot of people out here on social media that are unhappy, that don't want to see other people in any um, healthy or loving relationship. So they'll do and say anything, mm -hmm. you know, and then they're looking at your pictures. They're sending you evil eye, negative energy. They don't want y'all to work out. So you have to be careful. So I, I think because Latoya went through so much with the previous husband, and he, like I said, he showed his natural black, you know what, on that reality TV show. He oh, was he so mean out. and nasty to her. And he was allegedly cheating on her on top of that. And she was the breadwinner, allegedly, in their relationship. Yeah, he this behind. So, you know, just dealing with all of that drama, you know, I can understand why she wanted to keep this hey, marriage private. Darling. Yes. Because she went through a lot with her second husband. So. Okay, so what you saying is... I think ultimately what I'm saying, what she did is smart. And so what if she got three rings in eight years? And y'all, her ex-husband that she has the two beautiful babies with, he's so messy. He gonna put on his Instagram stories a picture of Tom Brady with his, wearing his three championship rings. And then he gonna caption it, three rings in seven years, dynasty. Basically throwing shade instead of being a good co-parent and saying, you know what, I'm happy for my ex-wife and her new marriage. Whoever she's getting married to, he seems like a nice guy, and and, and I'm excited. Yeah, that'll be and, too much, like right. And I'm excited to co-parent you know, with no him. Man finna do all that. for our two children, Gianna Not and Titan. Men. That's that's how he should have responded. Like he he should be excited. He should want to form a relationship with this man because he's gonna be in the same household with his babies. And if he got a problem with it, he should have thought about how he treated Latoya. Okay, let me ask you this. So what you saying is, ain't nobody gonna know about your boo. Y'all, you, you dating, ain't nobody gonna find out about your boo mm -hmm. on social media. You ain't gonna be talking about your boo to nobody. And you just gonna pop out married. Yes, I think that's brilliant. You don't owe people an explanation about your personal life. That's that's that like like we say with Shirley. Shirley don't have to Shirley Strawberry don't have to come out and tell us how she feel about the phone calls and Ernesto and so 